Hey everybody, welcome to this video. I hope you're well today. I hope you're enjoying yourself in this moment, sitting at the computer or traveling somewhere or whatever you're doing. My name is Owen, I'm from Ireland, and in this video I just want to talk about how focus is everything in life, and like there could be 10 things, 10 things right and one thing wrong, and we focus on the one thing that's wrong, and then we ruin all the ten things that are right. Well, or alternatively, we could focus on if there's like one thing right and ten things wrong, bad, challenging, hard in our life, awkward, etc. We can focus on <clears throat> on the one thing that's right and um, create a harmonious vibration of um, openness and gratitude and circulation of energy, free flow. And we can help transform and change positively all of the ten things that we don't prefer and make them work out with our higher vibration we'll find creative results and opportunities and tackle them in harmony instead of in resistance in allowance instead of resistance and tension so so the job is to find relief from your tension and align yourself with inner peace and harmony and how do you do that you simply go fishing for a thought or in, a, in your imagination expect the best to, to happen see the best happening um, tune into the feeling of how it feels to have this good thing that you want happening to you instead of visualizing things going wrong or bad which is the way we're typically wired to do at the moment in time so So we have the power of focus and our power to focus is our greatest gift and our most powerful tool. So we get to choose if we focus here or over there, if we focus on on the problem and, or the solution, if we expect and focus on what we, we want to happen or what we don't want to happen. And both will create different emotions. So I suggest focus on the one thing or anything the many things, the few things in your life that are working out well, that you like, that you're happy with, instead of the few things or the one thing that's most challenging or hard for you, okay? It's all about your energy. It's all about your alignment, your vibration, your energy, okay? This is the most important thing, to feel good, to feel happy, to feel well, tuned in, turned on, tapped on. <laughs> As Abraham, one of my favorite teachers, talk about tuned in turned on tapped on <laughs> tuned in tapped in turned on <laughs> but uh yeah get yourself to that place of feeling very good and then you'll be able to see the solution to your problems so much easier like really easy probably a lot of the times so i just uh in ireland eating some ice cream that sally made homemade vegan ice cream um coconut milk and stuff coconut cream just received the package just watching a bit of Jewel Survivor on my computer, getting a bit of sunshine, and just decided to make a little quick video for you. Because this has been obviously something in my life lately too that I've been practicing, and it's like it's very powerful to become more and more practiced at your your focus, to realize you have the ability to focus, and and to change your vibration by what you focus on and how you focus, how you see, visualize, imagine, etc this will change your life and it's just a matter of practice and making your how you feel the most important thing in your life only when you make what you feel how you feel the most important thing in your life will you be diligent and remember and remind yourself and start creating very well so i'll leave you with that just a simple short video it's, i think this is already explained well enough very effective and do keep practicing this so um yeah you have the ability to focus it's not what's happening on the outside that causes your emotions. It's not another person. It's how you're focusing and what you're focusing on and how much, in what way. It's basically simply your focus. So think about anything that can make you feel better in the last moment is how to align yourself. Anything at all. It could be something pleasant from your past. It could be, think about something going right in your life. So switch from the big issue, the huge problem weighing you down, the pressure, the tension, the upset and think about the time at the beach or the, the, the nice picnic you had last year or 
one of your favourite memories or what you're looking forward to or that you're appreciative of your food. Get specific. There's four levels. The worst is specific in what you don't want. This creates a lot of negative emotions. Then there's general. Like specific is like I hate when you do this, 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 and this. It's like really nitty picky. All the little details of what you don't like. That's specific negative focus which makes you feel the worst. Then above that is general negative focus. You're not as specific, but you're just saying, I don't like that. It's a crap day or something. But specific focus will be, it's a crap day because it's raining, it's wet, I feel cold, it's damp, it's dark. And you go on and on with the specifics. General will be, it's a crap day. <laughs> we need to be more or less like that. The next level is general positive. It's a nice day. But then the next level above that is uh, specific positive. It's a nice day because it's a nice day because look at the beautiful blue sky, the white clouds, the gorgeous yellow flowers of the dandelions. Because I get to do this, because I'm free to do that, because I, ha I have the ability to focus, because I have food, because I have a house, because I'm looking forward to going on a trip to the Bermuda Triangle, the Bahamas, the Caribbean, to, to the countryside. I'm looking forward to getting this thing in the post because this went right from yesterday because that went right for me last week so you're getting specific into the positive and that's when you feel like so much better in the positive side of emotions ah, so there you go guys liking my clothes and liking my shorts and i send you good wishes good vibes peace love and light happiness and joy creativity inspiration and all other good stuff from ireland okay hey Chloe. so that's that then and uh, enjoy your day Stay well and blessed and I'll see you next time. Feel welcome to share and of course give us a comment or else give us a like and I'll see you next time. Thanks.